Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are playing a bit of a mix and match friendly uh, Mexico and Panama. Won't actually be taking on each other. They'll be taking on El Salvador and Guatemala respectively. But those two sides not being on the match. Um, and hey, who doesn't like an international friendly? We're going to play Mexico versus Panama. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, please take a moment to do that right now. I would greatly appreciate it. We're going to play this fixture at the Camping World Stadium in uh, Orlando. That's where Mexico's match is going to be played. Mexico, Panama, Salvador, and Guatemala exchanging several friendlies between them in the United States. Mexico's friendly will be played right here. It says Exploria Stadium. That's the old name. Now it's the Camping World Stadium. All right, as the players take the pitch here in Orlando, Florida, USA, let's take another look around the now Camping World Stadium, home of Orlando City in the MLS, before we pause for the national anthem. Pre-match festivities and prepare for kickoff. Let's take a look at our starting lineups. For El Tree of Mexico, they line up in a 4-3-3. Raul Jimenez up top with Tecatito Corona and Hector Lozano on the wings. De Santos and Hector Herrera in central midfield. For Panama, they line up in the Christmas tree. Waterman up top with Carasquian behind your attackers to watch. Mateo in the middle formation, Mejia and goal. Snickers the back line. Let's look at our CONCACAF ball from Nike. Nike Merlin CONCACAF and we're underway here in Orlando, Florida. Again, these two aren't actually playing each other. They're playing El Salvador and Guatemala respectively. Those two sides not being on the patch. Oh boy, I wish they were. Everybody likes an international, so I'm going to pick these two against each other. Again, those four countries playing three different friendlies between them. Uh, El Salvador and Guatemala will play each other. And then uh, one's playing Mexico and one's playing Panama. One is playing Panama. I can't remember which is which now. I apologize for that. But Mexico's match will be here in uh, Orlando. The Panama match going to be in North Carolina, and the El Salvador-Guatemala match will be in San Jose, the Bay Area of California. Off sides there in Waterman, Panama started the final round of CONCACAF World Cup qualifying so well. that top three firmly and then fell to that fourth playoff spot and really right at the end ousted by Costa Rica but let me tell you this Panama side impressed they have really come a long way I think I had them pegged for seventh in this group in that group when that octagonal was announced and uh, yeah they finished ahead of Salvador 
ahead of Jamaica, ahead of Honduras. Jamaica and Honduras in particular. Pretty well established in CONCACAF. Wow, there's a goal. In from the right flank. Centered cross to Wolverhampton. Why Wu Jimenez? He hits a goal. It's 1-0. The old tree of Mexico. border in the south of the U.S. and well they don't touch directly with Florida uh, there are quite a lot of uh, Mexican nationals and people with Mexican heritage particularly in the southern states but all throughout the United States so you see that with a lot of other the uh, North and Central American countries as well so Mexico in particular always get a good draw wow nice dipping shot there so anyway, I've set them up to the home side because I do expect that Panama is quite a bit further away from uh, the U.S. And I have no doubt they'll have their supporters, but I expect the crowd support to be firmly slanted towards El Tree. Just again, due to the proximity. Ooh, cross in, not a good one this time. Mejia grabs it and sends it back out. Tito Corona, Jarrell Jimenez, Corona moved from Porto to Sevilla in the last transfer window. possession for Mexico. This incredibly one-sided. Panama need to assert themselves into this one. Keep some possession, get forward and create a chance to equalize here. They need to assert themselves and I don't think the long balls are the way to do that. Um, Waterman integral in the success of Panama's World Cup qualification bid. Even though they didn't, they're not headed to Qatar, they really showed how much they've grown since the last time around. They played really well. See Hector Herrera in the background there as Alvarez pleads his case. Hector Herrera, center mid from Atletico Madrid. Quintero. Takes the direct strike. The wall gets a piece of it. So it'll be a corner for Panama. There it is. That's right. Quintero. That's a great play. Short. They play it quick. Shucky Lozano. Woo! Nice defending from Mexico. Panama still in possession. Hector Herrera wins it back. Tecatito Corona of Sevilla, formerly of Porto. Head to Raul Jimenez. It's beat by Torres. He scoops it up. Torres enters that back four for Panama. He is the captain, and he is solid as a rock back there. Palacios joining in the attack here. Quintero. Andre Santos. Palacios picks it up for Panama. Oh, 
Jimenez. Tecatito Corona. Santos. Alvarez, the holding midfielder. Layun, the fullback. For Chucky Lozano, cross in for Raul Jimenez. Big bicycle kick as we enter the final quarter hour. Wide of the mark to be a little kick for Panama. Some of the younger viewers saying, Why does he keep saying Panama? Do yourself a favor and Google Van Halen. Diego Linez on for Chucky Lozano. Torres on for Arsenis for Panama, adding another striker to the mix here as they look for that equalizer. Oh, Corona to Jimenez trying to get it the rest of the way out. To Lozano. I'm sorry, that's Linez now. Linez of Real Batiste in La Liga. Substitute. Represented Mexico Whale in the Olympics this summer. Dispossessed here. What a season Real Batiste are having. Certainly in part due to the efforts of Linez. Godoy for Panama over to Carasquilla. Highlighted at the top. He gets a strike here. Woo! That very nearly went in. I think the keeper got a piece of that, so I think we're going to have another corner. Panama. Arrows sits it in. This will be our last bit of action, I suspect, because we are well in the stop. That's it. 1-0 to Mexico from Orlando, Florida. Raul Jimenez will take one man of the match honor for his goal. Raul will have the man scored a header. The victory for Mexico. Let's take a look at our highlights. Six minute. Tecatito. The overlapping fullback. Bicycle kick over the crossbar for Raul Jimenez. 24th minute. Again, the fullback, Leun, in to Jimenez. He's got enough space between the center backs there to head it home. And it's 1 0 to Mexico at this point. See, he is right between the two center backs. Chucky Lozano in the 30th minute. Nice dipping shot. Monterey man puts in a good effort there. Challenges Mejia. Stoppage time. Jimenez. This time from Tecatito. A little volley off the mark. I think Mejia had a cover anyway. Quintero shot. Knocked down by the wall. 76th minute. Jimenez again. From Chucky Lozano, another bicycle kick off the mark for Raul Jimenez. In stoppage time, Carasquilla has a look for Panama. Think an equalizer here. A little optimistic from that distance. Does go off of Mexico to create a corner. Ariano over the bar, and that was it for this one from... Orlando, Florida. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like, share it with a friend, leave a comment. If you aren't already subscribed to my channel, please take a moment to do that right now. I would greatly appreciate it. And again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.